Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises and all glory to the true and living power, which is Yahweh. Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Merka, Kodash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai is the true name of His only begotten Son. And there is no God beside them. And I want to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who definitely rule well, who have taught us this truth. And honors and citations to the elect that came doing these works in sincerity and in truth. So this is a very short clip from... um. The uh, TV series uh, Dragon Ball Super. All right, you know we all this show we all know and love. Oh, uh, this is about Frieza, and as you can see, the title says, "Well, first and foremost, like my man said, full credit goes to Tomi Animation. No copyright infringement intended. All copyright goes to the rightful owners. This is just for edification purposes, not for reselling." It says, Dragon Ball Super, Golden Frieza explains the mental training he did in hell with an epic evil face. Okay? So, as it says, man, he did a lot of mental training in hell. And that made him so powerful that he entered into a new form. Okay? And... You know, not only did he enter in, in, into this new form, he he uh, began to master it, right? And how he did that, he's going to uh, explain it, you know, so I'm going to tie it in to the spirit. <laughs> so, hey, there you have it. That's the power of the mind, man. That's the power of, of being... Of having a relentless mindset. Okay. Of having a diligent mindset. And of being austere and being serious. You know. As he said. He said in, in his. Because ultimately man. If you watch the show. Uh, uh, his hell. Was him being like trapped in a cocoon. Where he couldn't move. Right. He couldn't move. So all he could do is just envision. Endless battle simulations with Goku. And it actually made him stronger, man. Of just envisioning the victory. You know? So let me play one more time. Yeah. See? So the men mental concentration of just endless battle simulations, man. All right, just envisioning victory, and and ultimately that's us. Okay, so let me get the scriptures because, oh, whoops. let me get the scriptures because even in our subconscious, by constantly going there week in and week out, prophesying the downfall of this place. You know, and prophesying and in in in, in, in uh, uh, preaching the good news, the gospel. We are subconsciously, 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 and consciously envisioning the victory, man, and envisioning the downfall of this place. So, oh, uh, first scripture. Let me search this up real quick, because ultimately, man, in order to make it out of here. You got to be trained. We got to be trained to make it out of here. And that's exactly what Yahweh Shemashah is doing for us and has been doing for us. He has been training us, man. Just like with Frieza. Because when he said all he did was uh, ultimately meditate terror, all he did was have a constant... Battle simulation with Goku and envisioning uh, uh, destroying him and getting a victory over him. He was training. He was mentally training. 
You know, and he was giving it to Goku, man. He was a key factor when you check out the show. Dragon Ball Super, he was a key factor in the tournament. He did his thing. He lasted longer than like everybody else. Now, Goku ultimately was that dude. He's the main character. But Frieza did his Frieza did his thing, man. And where did it all come from? Where did all that strength come from? Mentally, mentally training, man. So it's the same thing with us. Every time we do our lessons, you know, three shows a day at least, striving to do every day. Every time we praying and fasting and doing all these things, going out there in the highways and byways, it's a form of mental, mental, mental training. And that's why Proverbs 22 and 6, and it's all praises and glory to Yahweh Bashem Ashtai. We didn't do this of our own, man. It's Yahweh Bashem Ashtai. He says what? Train up a child in the way he should go. And when he is old, he will not depart from it. So, and, and remember, the scriptures say, if you want to enter into the kingdom of heaven, you must be as this little child. So we have to be as children getting ready to be trained up, sighing and crying unto the Lord, you know, forgiving the Lord, no matter what he may do unto us, because that's an actual thing. That's an actual thing, getting mad at the Lord when he punishes you, getting mad at the Lord when he sends you some type of chastisement. People actually get like that. I know a guy like that. He said, oh, man, I don't believe in God. Why? Come to find out he, he, he uh, 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 um, his, the Lord took his mother when he was younger. So people actually get mad. But no, a child doesn't get mad at his parents. He gets his butt whipped and then he's good the next day. So these these are the, the characteristics of a child that we have to take within serving Yahweh Bashem because we the ones in the wrong. You know, but ultimately the Lord has been training us up for this day. He has been training us up for the beheadings. He's been training us up for us not be able to go into a, a Esau store to buy and sell because we don't have the MOTB. He's been training us up this whole time. He's been training us up for Jacob Shovel. And ultimately, he's been training us up for salvation. He's been training us up to become leaders of the whole entire earth, man. The whole universe along, well, under the orders of Yahweh Hashem and Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Yahweh Shai and King David, man. This has all been a mental training. Okay? Every time we sit down and listen into the Apostle and Elders Great Millstone, it's training. So guess what? The more training, the more stronger you can ultimately be. You know, if a guy puts in more, you know, and that's just uh, um, more so. That's not necessarily always the case, you know, but I just say that to, to to extra motivate, man, myself, first and foremost. And then those that that listen as well. OK. So this is uh, Isaiah chapter um, 33, verse six in wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times. And strength of salvation. The fear of the Lord is his treasure. See that? So the wisdom and knowledge is gonna is what's gonna keep us stable, man. Alright? Going back into uh, uh um meditating, all right, upon these times and staying in these scriptures, that's what's gonna keep us stable. That's what's gonna help us be able to hang, man. Because if you were uh, uh going back to this dude. A uh, freezer, Goku was, he always been physically training. But here it is, Freezer being being locked, being locked up. All he could do was mentally train, and yet he was still matching Goku, man. See, so that man, yo, that mental fortitude, man, is no joke. Okay, so the mental fortitude that we having through. Through, you know, ultimately through meditations, man, and just staying in the spirit and mental concentration, that's going to manifest in the physical heavily. That's going to manifest in the physical heavily, man, just like with freezing, man. You know, in that example with, with freezing and Dragon Ball Super. Okay. So let me just play this one more time. それは邪念を払って無心になるなどという嫌なものではありません。意識を
ただひたすらあなたを殺す戦闘シミュレーションに集中していたのです<笑>見えるあなたの動きが私の勝利が、yeah. we, and we gotta see it We gotta see it. We gotta see him coming down as a madman. And we do see it, man. Who see it more than the prophets see it, man? Before we were called prophets, we were called seers. See? <laughs> He said, I see it. Your movements, my victory. We see, we see the so called white man movements, man. And we not scared. The scriptures say in 2nd Edge, the 15th chapter, let not the incredulity of them trouble thee, man. Let me get that real quick. We see you. We see you passing your mandates, man. We see you trying the red list, trying to come after us, man. But we still see the victory, man. Okay? We still envision the victory. Through what? Through the scriptures. Yahweh Shai said in Revelations 3 and 10. You know, he's going to keep us from the hour of temptation. So no matter what happens, we see victory. All right, we see us getting spiritual powers if you try and come when when you not even if because it's not a matter of if this pink bastard is gonna try and come. It ain't a matter of if you if you is we see it when you come. We dream about it, man. We have visions about it, you know. Or we see ourselves being as men, being being ready to be beheaded for this truth, man. For your how about Shema was shy for the kingdom. We see it, man. We already envision it. All right. This is our second edges. Chapter 15. Verses 3. Fear not the imaginations against thee. Oh, the red list. We're going to come at you at 6 in the morning. Six weeks up before. You know? Yeah, that's their imaginations. The scriptures say fear not, man. Says, fear not the imaginations against thee. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness, man. See? So we see it, man. You know? It's, it's, been, a, it's been a mental training this whole time. All right? This is more so a mental battle than it is. If, that's why the scriptures say, the flesh profit of little. It profit of little, man. Is 90% mental, maybe 10%, uh, 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 90% mental, 50%, 10% physical, man. You see that, you see that one guy, Azar, Hill hooking Esau, he was up in the gym doing all the MMA. Where is he at? He ain't prosper because this thing is 90% mental, 10% physical, man, if that. Just, that's just me throwing out the numbers out there, man. We got to be mentally strong to serve you. How about Shema How is shy? Okay, you got to be you got to be on another level mentally to go out there in the highways and byways, man. You know how many people ain't trying to do that? They too scared to do that. They still care about what people think about them. This is a mental thing, man. Going right back with with, with Freezer. So we got to envision. The vic just like Free said, I, I see it. I see your movements. I see my victory. You know, we got to see the victory, man. And that's called what? Faith, man. That's faith. That's called faith, man. When you when you when we envision a victory, we can see it, and then we believe in it. That's faith. And without faith, it's impossible to please you. How about Shema was shy? You know? So a few quick words, man. I could have kept Kept going, going in, man. You know? But I'm actually on the clock. So, Lord willing, it was edifying, and I'm going to say Shalom.